You guys know what the fastest growing crime in America is? It is identity theft. And there's a new victim every 14 seconds. One of my brothers just recently experienced this. It was horrible, guys. He spent hours on the phone with companies trying to get everything situated. And to prove to, him, to prove to them that it was him, he had to send text messages to family and friends to let them know not to send this hacker money because it wasn't him. It was crazy. And that's why I'm excited to partner with today's sponsor, Aura. Aura is identity theft protection, fraud monitoring, VPN, password management, and antivirus software all combined into one easy use app. You might have one of these services already, but if you don't have all the tools, it's like locking the front door but leaving the back door open. Where are they doing that at? Those of you who have already had your identity stolen already are often shocked when this happens. Imagine trying to log into your email account only to realize that the password had been changed hours ago. And then later, you're getting notifications from your bank accounts, credit cards, and crypto accounts apps. Can you believe it? What are you gonna do? Who mm. oh, I will be horrified. Thankfully, Aura monitors the dark web for your emails, social security number, credit cards, and they do it quick by sending alerts really fast right to your phone and email. Thank you for that. Aura also gives you near real-time alerts on suspicious credit card activities as if let's say like someone who was um, opening a loan or credit card in your name or VPN allows you to stay anonymous online while keeping your browser history and personal information safe and encrypted protect your family and yourself from identity theft by going to HTTPS colon forward slash forward slash aura dot com forward slash SIBO and snapper if you sign up right now or will give you a two week free trial with my link to see how many times you'll see your personal information or your family's personal information on the dark web. And if you sign up, let me know in the comments below if your personal information has been compromised. You won't regret checking. Wow. But that's, that would, that's, so you have that, and but she has to agree to the marriage, right? Yeah, she, she has, has to be, want of to. Of course, it must That's be good. consensual. You know, long as they want, then once it's consensual, yeah. then she says, yes, I want to marry. Then he goes, go to the and then, father. And then you, uh, as a father, meet yeah. up with my father, and you bring your brothers, and my father sits uh, oh, with his brothers, and y'all yeah. negotiate. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I like, like that. that. Yeah. Me too. I like that. I like that. Yeah. They, they got a whole process. I love that. If, if, and, if, and if if families did more of that over here then i think marriages would definitely the ones that really ain't it that's true because, because your family members will truly let you know and they're talking you know that would be like a key way wow. if folks don't start showing up to me they don't want you dog but the sad part about it is you have you know a lot of fathers who are absent so that wouldn't be able to work in our culture true and that's not just in the black community yeah that's true I like that. You bring your daddy over here to meet me, and then to get my brothers, you bring your brothers. Anything pop off, we knocking your ass out. <laughs> <laughs> How about that? You better go then. You better go. All right, here we go. Uh, <laughs> uh, I ain't never seen Steve having this much fun, because when he was in America, he it wasn't. It's different. He was tired right, of him. Stop it. Stop it. Oh, uh, <laughs> One guess. Boom. <laughs> Numpamelo. Yes. Let's go, Steve. Numpamelo. Let's go. Do? I'm a lawyer, Steve. Oh, oh they shut up. <laughs> they crushing. That family crushing. Let's go. They killing it. Love it. Y'all better be some pretty girls and, and smart. smart. beauty and brains. Are you Let's married? Go. No, I am not married. Ah, uh, yeah, you're going to cost a lot. <laughs> <laughs> ooh, he's going to want all that money back from law school. Your daddy, ooh, you're going to be about sure. 40 cows. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, plus my sons ain't that smart, so. Stop <laughs> it! 
Name something that could end a friendship. If they steal from me, Steve. If they steal from me. That's got to be up there. What? Oh. Only one strike. What? Come on now. Lies. You lying on me. Nelisi wa. Nelisi we. Nelisi we. Nelisi we. Nelisi we. Nelisi we. Nuku Bello. What you do for a living? I'm studying education. Really? I, I knew yes, it. I just really thought to my sister she was going to be a teacher. You got gorgeous eyes. I'm not a teacher. Thank you. <laughs> oh, goodness. <laughs> I was thinking of education for some reason. She just gives me that. That. Great teacher, teacher. Educator. Yeah. Yeah, vibe. All of you. <laughs> Your mother's very pretty, huh? Our mother's, yes. Two wives. Huh? <laughs> My daddy got two wives. My dad's got two wives. Oh, Whoa. your daddy got two wives? Yes. Oh, come on, Pim. <laughs> <laughs> Stop it, Steve. You live in America. I give me a pass, <laughs> Stop I've been it. missing out. Stop I've it. got to come to Africa. I said, I bet your mother's pretty. Our mother's. Yeah. <laughs> what are you talking about? Our father has two wives. <laughs> Damn. Stop it. You gotta go I white can too. only have one. That's right. <laughs> Marjorie is not going to go along with two. Absolutely. <laughs> That's right. I can't take that in the house and tell that to this crazy person. I'm married to a crazy person. I can't tell her I'm going to have another wife. Of course not. Because she'll shoot me. <laughs> <laughs> Your wife is gorgeous too. Name something that could end a friendship. When your friend lies to you. Lies, I told you lies. To you. That's wow. up there. <laughs> told you. Name something that could end a friendship. A financial dispute. A financial dispute. Money. Good one. Money. Where is my damn money? Financial dispute. That's gotta be number one. Money. Money. Well, that's number one. One strike, name something that could end a friendship. A fight, Steve. A fight! <laughs> what? Uh, what? How? Of, of course a fight can end up. Did they say stealing already? Yeah, they say stealing. Okay. All right, Lucas, we gotta be careful. We got two strikes now. Parker family could steal. Name something that could end a friendship. Somebody sleeping with your wife? Somebody sleeping with your wife? Yeah. Oh, I'm finna kill. Or <laughs> <laughs> a husband. Sleeping with my wife. Or a spouse. No. Oh. And what is it? Sleeping with their sister or brother. Name okay. something that could end a friendship. We're gonna go with jealousy, Steve. Jealousy. Jealousy. That's so good. I didn't think about that. That's number oh. one. Jealousy. Come on, bro. Yeah. Yes. Number five. Misunderstanding. Two. Meddling partner. That was meddling, really good. Meddling, meddling partner. partner. What does that mean? A meddling what? Meddling partner. You meddling. Being nosy, I guess. Like nosy, looking through. instigating. I don't know. Meddling partner. I don't know. We don't know. We don't know about that line. Looking through my mail. Meddling. But it says partner. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I don't understand that one. I don't mm. understand that one. So did Steve do this show in Africa or did did um, African people come to America and they call it South uh, uh, Family Feud South Africa? I wonder if... I, I, I got the feeling Family Feud South Africa. I just got the feeling that they were in South Africa. That's what I that's feel. What they said. But how he commented, he said, man, I got to get a passport. Like, but you would have had to have a passport been already to come over. But he said, but the way they were explaining how far it was from where they were, he was like, oh, it's just like a two hour drive. We can take you there. It's a plane or a plane from where they're from where they are in South Africa. That's what I was assuming. I don't know. But you are not getting on a plane from America going to South Africa without a passport. Right. Because well, it's, it's fine when you get on that plane. But when it's time to get off. Right. How you going to get off? Yeah. Pointless. How you going to be in the country? Pointless. Yeah. <clears throat> that happened. Remember, we were going to the Bahamas. Uh huh. And we getting off the plane. Yeah. And this kid and their family member. Do you remember that? They were crying 
because they didn't, it was a passport or something they didn't have, so they had to get back on the plane, and the plane was going to have to take them all the way back to Seattle. Oh, I don't remember that. Yeah, you remember? We, and I had my biology book and all that stuff, remember? But they, like they were, was going to study it. <laughs> I ain't, boy, that didn't get looked at. I had, a, I had a test coming back, but I know I wasn't looking at that, bro. I know Ooh, I wasn't looking at it. I called myself. Yeah, so much The pilot fun. said, oh. You <laughs> just... <laughs> <laughs> As soon as you get out the plane, they playing the music, y'all. I mean, come boop, boop, on. Boop, like, man, throw it, forget <laughs> that one. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. That was, okay. that was crazy. Okay. Anyway, y'all. But I don't know. Let us know in the comment section, oh. y'all, if this is in South Africa or this yeah. is done, you know, here. I'm not, me, I'm not even going to look it up. I'm not going to look it up. I want y'all to tell me. Yeah, I got the vibe that they were already there. Because it's different cultures we know that, you know, are in South Africa. Yeah. So... There are, there are many different cultures in, in SA. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> like you said, man, what Trevor said, man, South Africa is Africa-like. So, um, yeah. it's, you know, it's like New York. But um, This was really, really good. I enjoyed this. We have got to do more of these. We sure will. Thank you for um, shouting this out because I love it. This was so fun. Yeah. It was so fun because when, my, um, when we're back home in Georgia, we watch Family Feud with my mother-in-law. And it's always and it's always so so always so action packed. So um, uh, yeah, yeah, she yeah, would enjoy sure. this too. Absolutely, man. Yeah. Well, All right, guys. We we'll see y'all in the next one, man. We we'll appreciate right. y'all. Don't man. forget to subscribe to the channel. Let's get this channel to seventy-five k. Share the video. Turn on the notification bell, and keep giving us that feedback. Let's go. Love you guys.